everyone! Today I will be showing you a fun macrame pattern that you can add to your different wall hangings or other projects. Let's get started. To begin, you're just going to need to attach six ropes to a dowel rod using a lark's head knot. Then using sections of three, we're going to work with the ones here on the left side first. And I'm going to take the string here on the far right and point it down into the diagonal towards the left. And I'm going to tie double half hitch knots around this rope in that direction. Working with the next section of three ropes, I'm going to take the one here on the far left and point it down and to the right diagonally and tie double half hitch knots around this rope. Working with the ropes in between my two double half hitch knots, I'm going to do one row of square knots, then two rows of square knots, and then one row of square knots. So I'm just going to take the four ropes right in the middle to tie my first square knot. Using the next two ropes and two ropes from the previous square knot, I will tie another square knot and this time I'm going to do two square knots. I will tie one more square knot using the four ropes in the center. Now I will take the rope here on the far left and go down to the diagonal to the right 
filling in half of my little diamond shape. I will repeat on the right side. I am not going to connect these two here to form a full diamond. I'm going to leave this open and then I'm going to take the string here and I'm going to go back down and to the left. Again, I will repeat taking this rope and going down this direction. like that. And now I'm going to do the same square knot pattern that I did up here, right here. So again, I'm going to start with the four ropes right in the center. Now I'm going to take both ends and go down into the diagonal. There we go. This is just a fun little pattern that you guys can incorporate into your different macrame projects. It will look great in a wall hanging or as a plant hanger. You can also add more panels this direction and make it longer so you can have a little fun with this. I hope you guys found this video helpful and inspiring and thank you so much for watching.